Good morning, everybody, and welcome back to another episode of Angler 24-7. I am here at Deer Creek early in the morning. We're going to see if we can catch some smallmouth at... How do I do this? That island over there. I can walk to it now, which is amazing. It's probably the best place around this lake, in my opinion, to catch smallmouth. So that's where we're going. We'll see if we can catch some. I'm going to grab my rods out of the car, and we'll head down to the water, and we'll see you down there. Honestly, just might go barefoot across. I can see where other people have been. It's just gonna suck. Your feet are gonna love me. Oh, it's probably gonna be chilly too. Here we go. You guys ready for this? I could have made it cross with my shoes on. It's not that bad. <laughs> Sandy. Whew. Okay. Whopper plopper right here. Tie it on. Let's see how it goes. I don't know what to expect, but we will see. Got one on my first cast. No way. First cast, guys. First cast smallmouth. Oh my gosh. It's a little guy, but it's something. Look at that. First cast smallmouth. <laughs> he's a little guy. But he's something. That was the first cast, guys. First cast, first fish of the day on the Whopper Plopper. My favorite way to catch smallmouth. There you go, buddy. Let's go, guys. That was the first cast. Isn't that crazy? Well, there was another one. That looked like a good sized one. Go back over there. That looked like a good one. Got him! Oh, little guy, but hey, that's pretty sick. That one that missed it was pretty good, though. Look at this little guy right here. <laughs> How did you get hooked, buddy? Second fish of the day right here. He's a little tiny dude. Later, buddy. That's pretty sick. They're all in this flat, it looks like. And they're hungry. It's a bad. Oh, there's... Oh, that feels like a decent one. Feels like a decent one. Like, it's okay, I guess. Stay down, buddy. He feels okay. You might be hooked weird. I don't know yet. All right, buddy, come here. Oh, no, he's actually pretty good. Best one of the day right here. Oh, there he goes. We'll call that a quick release. Pulled him out of the water. That was sick. There's one. Little dude. Fighting like a champ, though. Okay, okay. Alright, buddy. Hey, calm down, calm down. I don't want to hurt you. Killing it this morning. They want the plopper. I mean, we're catching fish, but that's not really the size we're after. We're going after something bigger. I want to see if we can catch something over, over a pound a day. Ooh, that's nice. That feels okay. This is insane, guys. Oh, my gosh. I haven't had a day this good on top water. Oh, that's actually a decent one right there. Stay down. Okay. Woo! Look at that guy. Oh, my gosh. This little smallmouth had so much fight in it. Holy cow. Well, look at that right there. Not bad. Not a bad way to start. I'll take a... Quick photo with this guy, real quick. Jump. Okay, this, I did not expect the, 
the day to start off like this, honestly. With this good of a uh, top water bite early in the morning. Oh, that one. Oh, that's good. That's, oh yeah, that's a good one. That's a good one. That's a, oh yeah, that's a good one right there, guys. That's a real good one. Oh yeah, he's digging. Oh my gosh. That's a real good one, guys. Holy cow. It's a really good smallmouth. Or it could be a largey. No, it's a smallie. Stay down. Stay down, buddy. That's a really good one. You guys don't understand that. That's, that's probably the biggest smallmouth I've ever caught in Utah. 1,000% right there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. You guys don't understand. <laughs> you guys don't understand. Look at that thing. That was the next cast and I got that thing. Right there on a whopper plopper. One pound, six ounces. Not a bad fish right there. Not bad at all. What is happening this morning, guys? I don't understand. I've never, I, last time I came to Deer Creek, guys, which was like, I think a week ago or so, I got skunked. I didn't catch a single fish. Then today, I have, I don't even know how many fish I've caught. Whopper Plopper, in my opinion, is my favorite way to catch fish. And then you just see an explosion right on it. You, you just, you don't, you don't, you can't get that excitement. Maybe on a frog, it might be the only, oh, there's one. He doesn't feel that good. Be something. Look at this little tyke right here. Little fighter. <laughs> He's pretty sick. Okay. Not now, buddy. Outside of the nose, that's interesting. <laughs> there's a little guy. See you, buddy. Woo! Okay, so it's decided to put on a jerk bait. Try this bad boy out. Horrible craft, holy cow. Good gracious. There's one. Stay down. Oh, he got off. Dang it. I should have set my drag looser. I'll do that right now. I'm walking further down this way now. And you can see that just the whole dynamic of the layout changes here. Okay, you can just tell it gets way more rocky, more gravel, little itty bitty small mouse swimming around. This is a dope area right here. Got some small mouth off this spot. Stay there, okay. We got a cracking craw. Takes us through style. Ah, I forgot. I haven't used this bait caster in a long time. Forgot the reels on the other side. Duh! When I bought it, I wasn't thinking. Man, I hate that this is on the other side. It's super annoying. It's my own fault. It's whatever. Oh, we have, a, we have one. Oh, we do. Oh, I missed him. I missed him. We had a bite. Oh gosh. I'm not used to setting that. I said I'm not used to setting the other way. I didn't feel him though. It'd be crazy if I caught a walleye. That would be something else. I have caught one walleye. Here and I was over there about a month ago, so about a few months ago. And uh, it was a little time to do. Oh, got one! I was I was just pulling up. Good gracious. Feels okay too. Man, I'm not used to fighting fish on this side. Oh yeah, he's pretty good. He's pretty good. Oh, it's a largey. It's a large map. Guys, it's a large map. Oh my gosh. Get out of there. Get get out here. Look at that guy right there. Oh my gosh. Woohoo! On the cracking craw, guys. Look at that dude. Look at that guy right there. Just smash that thing. Not bad. 
Look at that guy. Biggest fish of the day right there, probably. Five pounds, seven ounces. Well, you guys didn't see me. He kind of jumped out of the water in front of me. But what a day this has turned out. Look at the hot air balloons out there. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Isn't that cool? That's pretty dope. Oh, that was one. Pecked at it. But the devil kind of went to peck that. I was probably trying to kill it. Got him. Small mouth. Oh, he spit up something. He spit up something. Out there. Look at that. Second fish on the Kraken Craw. Destroyed the mud bug. There it is. Little probably half pound guy, maybe a little bit more. Here he goes. Sick. That fish destroyed this Kraken Craw. I don't know if you guys heard me say this, but I was saying that that fish spit up like what looked like a dead minnow or something. And the way I rigged this Kraken Craw is I, uh, took off the top piece and then just rigged it like normal Oop. just part way down just like that twist it around get it right up through the head I'm not the best at rigging things Takes me a minute because I'm not the best at it. I kind of went in that crooked. There we go. It's a perfect rigged cracking car right there. It's really cool for me about being able to come to this lake is that I live directly that way in that co in that corner of the mountain over there because. Well, that's a fish. He's messing with it right now. Do you have it? I think he dropped it. Oh, he has it. Oh. He just. Oh, he dropped it again. I think he's got it. Got him. No. Dang it. He dropped it. Get off. No. Do that to me. A little netty. See what it does. Hey, yeah. A little net the head. There's a little bug butterfly thing landed on the water there. I'm surprised the fish isn't decided. Hey, I'm gonna eat that. Oh, there's a little smallmouth right underneath him right now, actually. There's one. Nah. Oh, yeah. That's one. That's a fish. It's a little smally. What's up, buddy? Hello, I knew there were bigger ones around. I didn't feel you at first. How you doing? How you doing, you little pecker head? I'm the little netty. Nice little guy there. I'll let him go. Hey ya! Ah, I knew that there would be something out here that would want to eat that, I guess. Finally got one. We got a little tiger right there. A little bit of guy. Yep, got him. Little guy. That's a fighter. Little fighter, look at that little dude right there. On the little turd again. There you go, buddy. The little turd getting her done today. Little jerkin stick on. There's one. Oh my gosh. 
That was first cast too. Holy crap. He rushed that thing. Dang it. Well, I'd say that was a pretty good success today, I guess. We'll head back to the car and I'll do a wrap up. We made it back to the car and I'm done. I'm gonna head home. It was a pretty good day out at Deer Creek. Probably the best, actually definitely the best smallmouth bass fishing day I've ever had at this lake. I mean, we caught like double digit fish, which has never happened to me before at this lake. So it's pretty great. I'm gonna definitely come back here again soon. Early in the morning is when it seems to be good, especially on the top water in that cove over there. But anyways, Thank you guys so much for watching Angler 24-7 and we'll see you guys the next time the sun rises.